concern and some strong criticism swirling over an apparent racist act by a student. Well, that 18-year-old student was arrested yesterday, but the controversy over how the university handled the case continues to heat up tonight. News 8's LaSalle Blanks has the latest from campus. The latest from the University of Hartford today, the president of the university meeting with students to hear their concerns and try to help the campus heal. This incident has stirred up questions about race relations on campus. Do you guys think racism is a problem at your school? I never really sensed it, no. I would have never thought, it would, never be, thought it would be. The head of Connecticut's NAACP calls it. Totally disgusting. I've never seen anything this absurd uh, since I've been in civil rights. The president of the university is now being harshly criticized by some for what they say is the school's slow response. President Woodward says he's even received death threats. I probably received 2,000 emails, and uh, a number of them are, are very threatening. The president met with students today to hear their concerns and open up dialogue to help this campus heal, and some students give him credit. Meanwhile, Chanel Jazzy Rowe is trying to return back to a normal life on campus today. One of her friends says it has not been easy. Considering what happened, I, I'd say she's holding in there. She's I'm unbelievably sorry it happened. Uh, it is the act. Of a, of a person who made some really bad choices. People who live in their dorm say they had no clue until Brochu boasted online. She seemed nice, and then I, I heard what she did. Brochu has been expelled and arrested. She originally faced two misdemeanors, but West Hartford police asked the judge to add a hate crime charge. Jazzy is getting justice on social media. Multiple crimes is committed in this thing. Her friends are glad she spoke out. Every meeting that the school is having, I plan to be there. Every single one of them, I see. I plan to like check up on her. I want to know what's going on. President Woodward says he plans to meet with leaders from various student groups at least once a week to get a better handle of attitudes and issues going on here on campus. When it comes to this incident and racism, he calls it a wake-up call. At the University of Hartford, LaSalle Blanks, News 8.